Uh, I'm better. Ish. By the way. I still gotta blow my nose every five minutes, but, uh, yeah. Things have gotten better. So. That's good. Speaking of blowing my nose. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm on the, uh, I think I'm on the other side of this, whatever it is. I think it's like a cold or something. Uh, Tuesday was definitely the worst of it. So, uh, it's a good thing I called out from work, otherwise that shift would have gone very badly. Very, very badly. No, I didn't take any NyQuil, but I have been taking ibuprofen, which has helped immensely. In fact, when this is over, I'm probably going to take more. Because it is a pain reliever, and uh, the Game Awards are going on tonight. There's got to be a lot of pain involved in that. I'm going to need painkillers. <clears throat> Throat feels a lot better, too, so that's good. Throat feels spiky lately. Okay, what I took to help with that was these little things. Uh, Halls, it's menthol, cough, su cough suppressant, and oral anesthetic. They don't, they don't work for too long, but they work. Also, you can, uh, you can, tr also, you can, uh, take them, like, every two hours, which is, that's, that's pretty frequent, so that helps. They also, notably, 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 do not taste awful. So that's good. All the because all the cold medicine created by man usually takes tastes awful. Drink a Sprite Cranberry to help. You want a Sprite Cranberry? You remember those? Anyone remember those? Remember those, uh... Remember those Sprite Cranberry commercials? It's the holiday season. It's relevant. The Sprite Cranberry commercials, they, 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 they had the song. <laughs> it's the thirstiest time of the year. Thirstiest time of the year. <laughs> okay, phrasing, first of all. But, uh... Yeah, it was, uh been rebranded as Sprite, Sprite Winter Spiced Cranberry. Okay, that is hard to say. Sprite Winter Spiced Cranberry. Well, WH, I would argue water is better. Water is honestly better uh, any day of the week. But also, I feel that a hot beverage scorching down your throat is also a good way to go. Because, uh, it kind of distributes the pain throughout your entire throat, and that dulls it. So that's good. That helps. That helps a lot. Sinuses are still clogged up, though. I have not managed to fix that. I've been doing the Valsalva maneuver, like, all day. What? What is that? <laughs> Sounds like an old person move. <laughs> Is 
It kind of is. It, it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit draconic, but it works. The Valsalva maneuver is when you try to relieve pr pressure, the pressure in your middle ear. Swallowing or yawning, yawning usually does it, but, uh, holding your nose, closing your mouth, and trying to breathe out also usually helps. Ah, there it goes. Okay. Hey, God. Holding it. Holding it. It's just gonna go back to... Well, one ear works, at least, so that helps. It's like, uh, like what it feels like when you go in an airplane and the difference in pressure makes your ear feel all almost like it's clogged up. That's what it is. Is this sound coming from dead space? What is that? Can anyone else hear that? It's like this really quiet, staticky noise. Where is that coming from? Wonder if medical scientists could make a nose vacuum for people with sinus congestion. Okay, here's what you gotta do. Like, the Valsalva maneuver actually works. You close your mouth, you hold your nose, and you try to breathe out. Now, another thing, like, what I find to be really effective for holding your nose is you take your index and middle finger and use the knuckles to hold your nose because I feel like that gives you a better seal. It's also not going to feel as weird. And then try to breathe out. Like, like hard. Oh, good. The power was restored. <laughs> All right. Let me see where we left off. What about holding it in a similar way of diving? How did I do it there? Oh, wait, this is the elevator. <laughs> pinch both sides of the nose. Yeah, pinching doesn't really work for me. I find the, the knuckles work a little bit better. Because, like, with the pinching, it's like... A little bit of air still gets out. And then, and then you got snot on your fingers. And, hey, it's gross. 
with the knuckles, it's definitely a better... It's definitely a better seal. Man, all kinds of turned around. I looked at the other side of the tram to... Find this thing. Medical. I gotta go to medical. Yeah, this conversation is weird, but this is my kind of conversation. Because I've had to deal with this for years. Now arriving at medical. remember where cryo was <coughs> still just a little bit of a cough Just reinstalled it too. <sighs> so yes, we're uh, we're doing this instead of the game awards because every year I hate the game awards. Every year they get it wrong, and every year no one complains. Well, uh, except that one year when, uh, I forget which game won. I think it was Elden Ring won, and then some random kid ran up on stage and said, I'd like to dedicate this award to, uh, who'd they say? Bill Clinton? Something, Isaac? It's... let's call it a tissue sample. From Mercer's pet hunter. Careful. Who knows what mad science went into that thing? Maybe I could find out. Figure out what Mercer's up to. There's gotta be a working DNA scanner around here. Okay. Worst injury I've ever had? That's, uh... That's a great question. Because <laughs> I honestly don't remember it. <clears throat> I think it might have been a... I think it might be a repressed memory. If you're talking about me, Nate, I have been shot. <laughs> and boy, let me tell you, video games really downplay getting shot. spot, as it were. The X button, follow the line. <sighs> They're getting lazy in this section of the ship. I haven't seen a single necromorph.
Are you afraid of me? You should be. Finally. Dude, where have you been? <laughs> oh, hi. How are you guys holding up? Ah, shit. Okay. <sighs> there might be a Dead Space alien crossover. No, there never will be because Dead Space actually has dignity. Aliens clearly does not, especially with the third movie. Oh my god. No problem. Get your vaccines, kids. Find Harris's ICU bed. Can't be too hard. Where was the ICU? Remember. <clears throat> Ow! <sighs> All right, I just got injured by the slowest moving door, and no, Dead Space was not inspired by the thing. Dead Space was inspired by Aliens, Event Horizon and a couple of other sci-fi horror movies. Thing did inspire Among Us. Yeah, but Among Us is terrible. Oh, what the, uh, what the fuck is that noise? <laughs> Sounds like a drill. <laughs> All right, Harris, where's your, uh, where's your bed? Why is it further in? Why is it really close to Mercer's office? Why is it, like... 
right next to Mercer, right next to Mercer's office. Okay, is this legal? Okay, I think this goes against his Hippocratic Oath. ICU bed was right next to Mercer's creepy office. Strangest movie I've ever seen is probably either Paprika or Tokyo Fish Attack. Cut through the mall. Excuse me, cutting through the morgue. This is why this particular mission is going to go really, really smoothly is because we've already cleared out all these areas. But Stanley Kubrick? Nah. It's either Paprika or Tokyo Fish Attack, definitely. Yeah, 2001 A Space Odyssey is that I don't consider it odd. I don't cons consider that movie odd. I do, however, consider 2001 A Space Odyssey so unbelievably boring. So it said ore storage? That's down in mining. Eyes wide shut. Have you seen 2001 A Space Odyssey? It's boring. Now arriving at Mining Engineering. Check station when departing. 
Worst part is, it probably wouldn't be if they just cut out all the fluff. That fluff being all of the extremely slow, slow shots of spaceships landing. Those ten minute long sh oh Right. I now you get out of this hallway, hang on. Power restored. Oh god, the power's been restored. Why did it say that? Why are you fellas giving me a hard time now? Give me that! <coughs> the Shining? There was nothing weird about The Shining, it was just a man who lost his mind. Stop saying that. And actually, I think he figured out out by the end why he was losing his mind. All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. He's like, man, I don't want to work on my book. My real passion is painting. And he just wanted to paint snowy landscapes like, uh, like that dude who paints. Bob Ross. <laughs> he just wanted to be Bob Ross, guys. All right, what floor are we going to? Meaning. Meaning. We have to go to the meaning floor. Someone left corpses in here. I think it was me. A lot of corpses. God, plasma cutter ammo. Yeah, for some reason it stopped giving us those.
Well, there isn't much here. There isn't even a lot of ore storage here. Oh, no, wait. There is ore storage. It's core samples. Quite a few core samples, actually. Security request retrieved. Security, we got some freak called Harris stealing from ore storage. Oh, no. Dr. Mercer sent me for Osmium to complete his work. Yeah, I don't care if God Almighty sent you. You skim from CEC's profit margin, we get screwed. God? So it's just a little bit of Osmium. Down, or I can break your arms first. I worked with people like you on Aegis 7. They'd steal my power nodes. Leave me to dig with no light. Hey, hey! Get off me! But when they abandon you in the dark, it's not empty. The marker whispered its revelations there. Now I understand them. Do you want to hear? Warning. Untrained personnel may not use suit PR. No, no, stop, please! I said please when they shut me in. Screamed it too. I promise I won't laugh like they did. Warning, since Kiosk is obstructed, serious injury may occur. Oh, God! Help me! <laughs> Incident report filed to bridge by Dr. Nicole Brennan. See related rig activity. The guy done lost his mind. He just killed a man with a store. Okay. We're going to the bridge. Saying that, plans for Christmas? I don't know yet. I wanted to do like a war on Christmas stream, but I haven't decided if I'm gonna do that yet. Viper, they killed a guy with a store. I'm gonna be saying that for- I'm gonna be saying that for weeks! Hey, remember when we were playing Dead Space? And he killed a guy with a store? <laughs> yes, Nate, in the broadest possible sense, yes, he killed a man with a store. What about streaming some Christmas games? We do have that Viscera cleanup detail. What's the latest thing you need to cut to pieces? Uh... In all seriousness? Not much. Things have been pretty quiet since we, uh... ran back over to medical and, uh... Picked up that tissue sample. Yeah, Santa's rampage. I was thinking of bringing it back. I haven't honestly decided yet. Haven't had a lot. Error. Power routing malfunction. Please stand by.
Okay. But yeah, I haven't decided on that. I've been sick for the past few days, so... Finally coming off of that, though. We did it! Have Isaac! A ship just shot in! The USM Valor! They must have heard our SOS! That fast? What's a military ship doing way out here? Out on patrol? Whatever, right now I take a rescue from a fucking magpie. Magpie can't save us. Communications. Once we fix the comms array, we can get all the answers we need. Okay. We gotta fix the comms array. We also have to find somebody's rig. We have to find that report that was filed with the bridge. <clears throat> we also have to... Well, we gotta find Mercer's private quarters. Is this it? Log retrieved. Captain! more time to record this. Satisfied? No, I'm not satisfied. We have a dead miner. We can't sedate Brand Harris. Wasn't Harris originally your patient? Could have warned us that he could deserve it. Don't interrupt this! Oh, now it's a vendetta against Dr. Mercer. So, now he's making it a religion thing. Man, fuck you! <laughs> this is the equivalent of the captain saying, Oh, I can't get vaccinated. It goes against my religion. See, he sometimes says funny things when he runs out of ammo. He hasn't been doing that. Oh, come on, man! Stop, you stupid bastard. You've got no arms left. <sighs> I'll be honest, I was trying to listen to that, but I couldn't. Spikes on local comms. If whatever's wrong with the comms array is spreading, no, that's not it. So, uh, uh, the door to communications should be open. You can head down to the comms control station. And Isaac, watch what you say. I think someone's listening in. What was the equivalent of the guy refusing to get vaccinated? Uh, this. more time to record this. Satisfied? No, I'm not satisfied. We have a dead miner. We can't sedate Brand Harris. Wasn't Harris originally your patient? You could have warned us that he'd go berserk. Captain, Harris is suffering from a dementia that we don't fully understand. He was making progress until Dr. Mercer took his case over my objections. I've read that. And frankly, this, this vendetta against Dr. Mercer just sounds like more of your bigotry. My what? Do you deny that you've counseled members of our church and turned them against you mythology? I'm telling you that Mercer's treatments are immoral and dangerous. And why does he keep taking Harris to hydroponics? Medical is a sanctuary, not Mercer's private lab, so stop covering for him. More accusations, but still no proof. You know your way out. He won't stop with Brand Harris, Captain. You know that. Tracking related rig activity. 
This whole ship is full of these unitology fuckheads. He's like, oh, yes, um... Yeah, he's doing some fucked up shit down there, but, uh... You see... He is a fellow unitologist. And you? Are an anti-unitologist, and therefore I don't respect your opinion. This whole fucking crew is just full of shit. We picked up a node. Never mind. Uh, broken cobs array. Oh, well, actually, actually, hydroponics is next. What was he doing there? Hmm. Hydroponics. Mr. Harris, oh, Mr. Mr. Harris, what were you doing in hydroponics? Maybe this is where he was hiding out after the murder. They had the murder weapon. It was a store. Dead miner. But you would have had to expect someone would die on this ship. You have a morgue. So then again, I would argue you might want a morgue for a ship that has over a thousand people on it. That's just common. Do not exceed maximum load. 2,600 ki kilograms. Twenty-six hundred? You're still looping this? This is Dr. Elizabeth Frost. You're still looping that? Our aim, no accidents. Yeah, you've been doing a great job with that so far. Apparently a gold semiconductor counts as a rare specimen. You have bug phobias. Yes, but who doesn't? Snake phobia. Snakes are cute. In fact, all animals are cute in their own way. <clears throat> well, 
Like, think of one of the ugliest animals you can find in nature. The alligator, for example. This is kind of cute. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God. Yeah, that's what that does. Apparently that was the end. Prototype stasis module. What's prototype about it? Does it last longer? Does it make them stand completely still? Eels look scary. Eels are cute. Does it rip off ever? Does it rip off all their skin? Because apparently, yes, it does. That's what it does. That's what the prototype stasis module does. It rips off all their skin. I can see the utility of a stasis module. Like, sometimes you need a machine to stop and you don't have time to go hit the power button or something like that. But this! This could kill a man! Uh, they really got to get a maintenance guy down here to fix these stupid things. This one is meant for combat. And what's it doing on this ship? This is a mining ship. You give... I wouldn't even give a pulse rifle to the security crew on this ship. That you can use a you can use a you can use pistols on this ship, not a shotgun. Let alone an assault rifle. Wait. Yes, we're we're doing comms next. We've just been uh, neglecting uh, some of the side missions. There's two of them, and we just completed the first one. The next one we can't complete. Let com we can't complete yet. We gotta 
get access to the crew quarters. I don't have that yet, so, uh... Let's PTFO. Today is Pearl Harbor Day. Ah, so it is. Okay. Maybe now we can finally take a break from this goddamn tram. Relief begins with relaxation. We have a spa on board? Well, yeah, maybe. Working on a mining ship can be very stressful. Right, because that goes to the crew deck. This... All the way down goes to the comms array. Yeah, it's I had to blow my nose again. What a 48 star flag to fly outside my house. <laughs> It'll be a cold day in hell <laughs> before I recognize Florida and Ohio. <laughs> Oh, it's one of you. Well, I got the perfect tool for the likes of you. You too? There are two. Perfect tool for the likes of you too. Florida man. You guys excited for Florida Man Simulator in 2025? Clearance confirmed. You know, I never was the biggest GTA fan. Uh, 
I didn't really like GTA 4. I didn't want to go bowling that much. I never did finish GTA 5. And uh, GTA Online is so goddamn broken and full of hackers. It's unplayable. But you know what I did like? I did like Vice City. I did like Vice City. That one was good. Oh, Michael, welcome. We're just heading down, uh, down yonder to, uh, the comms array. Ah, we're here. Array offline. A repair technician has been notified. Yeah, we got the notice when we got on board. The Valor's in a holding position. How's the comms array? <laughs> Fry? Someone hot-wired the dishes together and blew up the system. So we screwed. No, it was sloppy work. Some of the dishes are intact. If I replace them and create a new circuit with no gaps, we could broadcast a signal. Short range only, but it should work. Okay, do it. I'll, uh, keep an eye on things here. Thanks, Kendra. Helpful as always. Communications log. First comms operator Bailey reporting. I want this on record. The ship is under attack, but Captain Matthias has refused to issue a distress call. And we all know why. This whole operation is illegal. Aegis 7 was sealed off. They knew it, we knew it, and we all kept our mouths shut. That ends now. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. This is USG Ishimura calling C. Wait, what the hell? Jesus. He took the whole comms array offline. It's over. Sorry, Bailey. <clears throat> is the opposite of Pepsi Man is Coke Girl? A war as old as time itself. Coke versus Pepsi. Unsent message retrieved from array buffer. Unsent? Oh. <gasps> Captain! Support, Captain Benjamin Mathias to Paragon Jordan, Una. This will be my last transmission. Afterwards, I'll make sure our pilgrimage can be completed without interference. What's this shit? We have successfully brought the holy marker on board. Dr. Kine, an expert on the original marker, is deciphering its secrets. Uh, forgive me. For quarantining you just seven. Director Eckhart's work may have been inconvenienced, but they're suffering some sort of epidemic. Regardless, Planet Crack begins tomorrow on schedule. CEC can scratch out its illegal operation now that the true prize is ours. Let's see Earth go try to cover this up. Altman be praised. With eyes up. <laughs> I only want to know if you're going to watch the Game Awards. Nope. Uh, in fact, in all of our notifications, I said we were going to be doing this instead of watching the Game Awards. I don't respect them. They always, uh, they always reward the wrong games. They don't nominate the games that they should. And, uh, in 2020, uh... The Last of Us Part 2, a game everyone disliked, if I recall correctly, that was getting a lot of hate online, won all the awards. And then this year, they didn't nominate Starfield for Game of the Year, they didn't nominate it for anything, Pikmin wasn't nominated for anything. And they nominated... Bungie for best community support after they fired half of their community support staff So yeah, we're not doing it this year if they Drop a neat trailer. We might go look at it But it's gotta be like really neat guys 
Like, if they don't announce Titanfall 3, I, I don't know if we're even gonna look at it. Okay, stop doing that. I only had to hit that guy three times. How powerful is this stasis shit? They're also using the whole Latin landing thing, which is which sounds stupid. They also nominated Dave the Diver for best indie game, even though it isn't indie. And then the host had to go on Twitter. I will not call it X. He had to go on Twitter and start spouting off and starts jump starts jumping through uh, hoops trying to explain why it is considered for the indie category. I just watched the awards for the trailers. Yeah. If they drop a cool trailer, and I do mean cool, we will go and look at that trailer. We will stop what we're doing here and we'll go look at it. That's a big if, though. Like, Last time we stopped what we were doing to go look at a Game Awards trailer, they announced the Expanse game. No, I didn't see the GTA 6 trailer. I honestly don't care that much. God bless. Oh, he does. Believe me, he does. <laughs> All men be praised. Fucking unitologists. I don't think this is gonna work. What if... Why won't you come out? Come on. Thought your name was Nate. It is Nate. I made a... I, be, I made a dead space joke. Because all the unitologists are like, all men be praised. Fuck all of them, though. <laughs> Why won't they come out? Come on! Alright, now this will work. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. I'm an engineer. I 
I definitely will not break this thing. Need to find some way to plug this one in. <clears throat> We're close. What if we just put this on the other side? Just put it on the other end of the line here. No power to central node. Oh, so we were trying to reach the middle. I really wish you told me that before I uh, went off on a tangent here. And by tangent, I mean just plugging them in wherever I want. I would just call it Twitter X. Twitter X is long. I do not want to call it Twitter X. There was nothing wrong with Twitter. Twitter X is just an extra syllable now. Everyone's making uh, all those simplified logos. I think we should... Uh, be more focused on simplified names. Good. No. Apparently not. Oh, because it's got to plug into that one. No, I haven't thought about making my OC as a murder drone. Why would I do that? Why would I do any of that? straight one Okay so Broken comms array. Right. Oh, uh, wait, 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 that's brilliant.
It's just sitting there going, I can't get it. This should work. There's no hose connected right there. God damn it! Wait, this is an easy fix. You ever wonder why at the beginning of the game, Isaac said 48 hours max to fix this thing? That's why. I think you got it. Try opening a channel to the Valor. Send an SOS to the world. This is USM Valor, broadcasting on all frequencies to USG Ishimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod number 47 and are en route to your position. Wait, what? This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. <laughs> Escape pod. Oh fuck! The pod Hammond jettisoned. It had chip. That creature was inside. No, 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 no. USM Valor, come in. Ah. Uh. Valor. Oh, her signal isn't strong enough. Can we deploy the long range antenna? No, something's blocking the blast doors over the comms array. The hell? There'll be a manual release over at maintenance. I'll go. Keep trying to reach them. Is this a never-ending slew of problems with this ship? I swear! Get the fuck out of my way. Alright, hang on. I need stuff. Especially since I'm down to nine bullets on the plasma cutter again. It's not even bullets, it's... It's whatever. It is pang. Everyone wants pang. There's always pang. I don't know what pang is, but... I do know that everybody wants it, and there is always it. on the line gun.
Oh, hey, you're alive. You're not. Oh, I hate this dude. He separates into a bunch of little creepy crawly dudes. <coughs> Where's that guy that I just... Shit, I just fucking blasted him, didn't I? Attacks can knock enemies prone. Yeah, okay. The fall apart. That's what we're calling it. I never actually gave him a name. I usually just call him, oh, it's that guy that uh, separates into a bunch of creepy crawly dudes. <laughs> that, uh, so I guess that was his name. What other plasma cutter upgrades are there? Line gun, force gun, just this one. Yeah, let's hold on to that money. Don't have good aliases for the necromorphs. Well, the one that fire, the one that has three, the little one that crawls on the wall that. It, three tentacles come out of its back. That is called the Lurker. Like, that is its actual name. The big fat one, that is the Pregnant. Those are the two that I know. Okay. Did you change the way it looks? The front of it, it's no longer yellow, it's black. Boop! Wait, let's try it out. It works! <laughs> it works good! That doesn't sound good at all. We're right around that point in the in the first game where we had to use a turret to fight the Leviathan again. Error. Glass doors obstructed. Please contact a repair technician. I am the repair technician. You can't reach the Valor. What's happening with the antenna? It's blocked by. It must have snagged on the comms array after we spaced it. It's not coming off without a fight. 
Isaac, there's no time. There is if I use the ADS cannons. Manual targeting like before. I can shoot it right off the hull. I got this. You focus on the Valor. Will do. All right, let's kill it again. Oh, the one that throws up on you in Dead Space 2, that is the puker. It's a very on-the-nose type of name. Damn it. There's another one, right? Yes, I can see the laser. Uh! Should probably be uh airborne for this. Can shoot them down, but not very well. Ugh. Ah, get shot at, idiot. Oh, wow, okay, he didn't like me calling him an idiot. <laughs> what are these, mines? Are you shooting mines now? Oh boy, here it comes. Mines that don't explode. Why don't I shoot them? Get this crap off of my gun. <laughs> Your minds are no match for my gun, you idiot! What? Fuck it. Okay, stop it. Are you about ready to die? Good. Uh. All right, all right, we gotta hurry before they open that escape pod. Uh, we gotta hurry before we oh, before the before the, before the, before the uh, yeah yeah. Yes, finally, USM Valor. This is Kendra Daniels on the USG Ishimura. Do not open the escape pod. Repeat, do not open that escape pod. Do you read? <laughs> oh God, they opened the escape pod. Uh, 
Um. Um. <laughs> okay, now you chime in. A rescue ship. They found your escape pod. And the one that used to be Chen, it... God damn it! The Valor scrap. By the time another ship hears the SOS beacon, we'll all be dead. No, that's what I was telling you. I found an executive shuttle on the crew deck. Intact. Wait, what? The log says that shuttle's missing its singularity core. Oh. It can't get us home. Never mind. Wait, maybe it can. Huh? If the Valor singularity core is okay, I could salvage it. Install it on that shuttle. We're fucking out of here. Where's the Valor now? It's near comms. Keep us stable. Isaac, I'll grab a suit and EVA onto the Valor. Meet me there. We'll find that core together. Let's see if he clean up their own mess. I'm saving what I can. Okay. Finally. Hammond is on the same page as the rest of us. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. Ugh. Honestly, a bit of a miracle that it isn't in more pieces. Isaac, I'm on board. Already? I'm trash, but I can make it to the bridge. The hell was that? Probably more necromorphs, god dang it. <laughs> Exiting zero gravity. Ooh, different voice. Hello. Exiting vacuum. Dead on arrival. Yeah, that's uh That's the Valor, alright. Dead on arrival. Oh boy. Isaac, we have a problem. The battle yeah. is carrying a 12 megaton warhead. The crash hit the torpedo bay hard. I need you to handle that nuke right away. What? Before something sets it off. <laughs> handle 12 megatons? You know I'm not a nuclear engineer, right? I don't need you to be. Just stabilize the warhead and eject it away from the Ishimura. Christ, damn it. No one trained you to carve up monsters with a plasma cutter either. You haven't let us down yet. This is very, very different! <laughs> yeah, you've been chopping up uh, people with uh, assault rifles and heavy artillery. Now, uh, how are you at nuclear disposal? Sorry, buddy. We've got to make sure. Hey, how you do? Okay, you don't look so good. Uh. Okay, hopefully that that did not slow him down. What the fuck? Okay, yeah, I don't like that. When they were turned, those units merged right into their bodies, changed them. They're fucking fast, Isaac. Stay sharp. That's fucking stupid. Wow, I don't like that. Briefing room. Is 
CC vessel USG Ishimura in breach of EarthGov system isolation order, believed to have recovered marker 3A. 3? Three? As in you have more than one. Special Ops has confirmed the system, but unable to provide planet location. How do you lose a planet? Lost a planet, Commander F. Cadigan has. Most embarrassing. Most embarrassing. Mmm. <laughs> Star Wars Episode 2. Exercise extreme caution if Marker 3A has been recovered on board. Infection is a credible threat. Orders shock point to Aegis system move to position out of local scope range and await signal from Ishimura to confirm location. Objective secure Marker 3A. If infection is present, initiate sterilization protocol Uridus. If infection is not present, initiate containment protocol Apollo. All personnel must, without exception, submit to full psychological examination during debriefing. Mm. Lost a planet, they have. Yes, I see the audio log, and I'm going to continue to clean this place up. There's a lot of bodies around. Wouldn't want any of them turning. This is Commander Cadigan to all hands. We have been boarded by hostile forces. Hostiles are aliens. Repeat, alien and extremely dangerous. Aliens! All personnel, two arms. Fire at will! Aliens! Whoop. Hello. Oh! What's wrong? No bodies to convert? <laughs> and that is why we stomp all the corpses, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Ooh, wait. Just thought of something. Ah, ah, ah. Yes. Little green men. Or what were they saying yesterday, little green pissant? Where does this go? Huh. I don't think this goes anywhere. I think it's just an extra one. Alright, we don't need this one. I don't even know what that thing was powering. Well, now we need this one. Huh? Who's calling me? Hello? I, I must speak with you. Who is this? Dr. Terrence Kine. The Ishimura's chief science officer. I, I studied the marker for the church. I was about to I'm say, aren't talking to you, Natologist. But, 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 but the planet won't rest until the marker is returned. You, you can't leave. Watch me. <laughs> Caution. Radiation. So now the Unitologists are calling us up and being like, Mr. Clark, do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior, Michael Altman? You're a cult. So, no. Oh, dear God. Caution. 
right. Nukes. Oh dear god, explodey arms are here. Because of course they would be! I'm containing- oh dear god. And we're out of stasis! No, 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 you'll kill us all! Man, these things are really, really stupid. Like, really, really stupid, apparently. Okay, don't let that blow up. Got him. Okay. okay, we're gonna have to... ...carefully remove these fuses. Eurydice Yurid Mod 1. Okay. So you were going to... So Protocol Eurydice is just a nuke. Uh-huh. <laughs> Not taking any chances with this, I see. Power required. Uh, okay. Is there a power core nearby? Yes. Okay. just on patrol why bring a nuke and if they had a target what's out here except us yeah i know i'm downloading a munitions report right now i'll clear your route to the engine room grab that singularity core and let's get out of here <sighs> nuclear weapons Yeah, we are saving after that because that was an actual pain. Uh, has the show started yet? Have they dropped any trailers? Does anybody know? Did somebody say something? Armory. Get me some. Ow! I was gonna say, get me some ammunition.
Ammo. Yes. Ammo. Yes. Ammo. No. Oh, dear God. Two? What do you mean there are two? I don't want to deal with one. Plasma cutter ammo. They are really pushing for us to use the plas- The- No, not the plasma cutter. Pulse rifle. They are really pushing for us to use the rifle. Shooting range! Plus 15, minus 25. Yeah, okay. Shooting range online. Caution. Live fire exercise. Interrupt my shooting range! I ain't gonna let this interrupt me. Where's the next target? Bring it. I'm not done with you yet. Shooting range out of service. Please contact maintenance. Great. We must have broke it. Thanks, jerks. Well, I scored 2100. How'd you guys do? <laughs> Oh, you're alive! For now. Um, you. Well, now he ain't. 
Even though his rig is still... I don't know. No, there it goes. Well, I'm gonna do you a favor and, uh... Make sure you don't go necro. Ugh! Ugh! Yeah, uh, buddy, I don't think you wanna... I don't... I don't think you wanna go through that. Look at that, it's chopping bits off of him. Schematics for large med packs. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole, I'm working on it. What did I say about calling me while I'm working? It took forever to turn! Ugh. It took forever to spin! Stupid thing. Okay, laser! Here comes Dave! You didn't get very far. Sorry, Dave. You broke the lasers. Again, Nicole, I'm working on it. Now, why'd you go that way? <laughs> what? Why did he do that? Why would he do that? Maybe he just really likes lasers. Like, ooh, lasers! He's losing it. Hammond is now losing it. Ah. And here is the escape pod. Only took one of them to chop up a whole lot of you, huh? Well, let me just make sure none of you go necro. Why is it only one... How do I know? There's a couple of chairs in there. I feel like you could fit way more people in this thing, though. It's an escape pod. You should be able to cram it like at least 10. At least 10. Unknown biohazard. Oh, great. It's ripping open its chest. This was not a good plan. 
Why won't you die? Oh. It did. Ah. Shit. I need more of this. Now stay down. For the love of God! What does the black hole do to ya? Honestly, not much. Feel like we're going in circles here, buddy. fast as fuck boy. <sighs> I am begging you. The Valor's munition lost. Uh, hmm? It wasn't just a nuke. They came loaded for war. She can destroy. This was no patrol. They knew about the Ishimura. Someone knew. We were all dead, from the moment we arrived. Interesting. So, they were vividly aware of our illegal mining operation out here. They just didn't know where the planet was, which is still a bit weird. Like, how do you how do you lose a planet? One with breathable atmosphere, no less. Extreme radiation. Luckily, we're wearing an engineering suit. Which very, very likely blocks out all forms of radio radioactive uh, contamination. All the engines we work around and all that. I would hope that comes standard here in the super future. Now, if only they could do something to make these suits fireproof. That should be good. I might need that on the other side. Thank you. I work in a hazardous workplace environment, which operates at the average temperature of 4,000 degrees Kelvin. I'm gonna need more than one box here. Okay. 
Fire suppression system is on. Elevator systems are working. Hey, 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 how do you say? I come from a place called the... Run across. They'll die. See? Toasty. Very toasty. Double toasty. <laughs> uh, I won't say no to the fire cleansing my problems. Piston engines. You'd think we'd evolve a little bit beyond that. Hey, there it is. Hey, Emmett. After you, some more's in the red. Someone get the door open. Emmett, you're. Chen. Christ, what did this thing do to you? Help me get him to the Kelly. Sock shit. Shoot him. What? <laughs> Shit. Core's okay, though. Good. Reroute. Tim and Vital, they just flatlined. He. Him, it's gone. Him and shit. Oh my god. What? I pulled out one piece! Why is the whole ship gonna blow up now? I pulled out one fucking thing. Buddy, we do not have time to fight this out. In case you missed the bulletin. We are currently on an exploding spaceship. Now the heat exchanger is dead. That is important. We do need that. It exchanges the heat. What is it exchanged for? The ship not exploding! It's kind of important. Uh, this looks familiar. That's why it's making you vividly aware that the heat exchanger is in fact offline. Yeah, I get the gist of it, guys. <laughs> Ow. Incoming 
All right. I think we're gonna live. Oh, great. What about the Valor Singularity Core? It's covered in blood, but I got it. God, I hope Hammond was right about that shuttle. He said it was on the crew deck, along with every unitologist on the ship and their marker. You need to... Wait, someone opened the door near the bridge atrium? It'll get you to the crew deck, but who's left with that kind of clearance? Isaac, something's up, but we have to get that shuttle. For God's sake, um... be careful. We're all that's left. The chief engineer, perhaps? Exiting zero gravity. I think Temple is still skulking around. Oh, hi. They just lured me with something shiny. Oldest trick in the book, lure them with something shiny. Wasn't that actually in a book? They were... Yeah, yeah, it was. It was a book from middle school, Where the Red Fern Grows. Anyone remember that? Where the red fern grows? They were out hunting raccoons and they were like, lure them into the trap with something shiny. For the record, I don't know why it was called Where the Red Fern Grows. Might have been something way, way, way at the end of the book. Probably unrelated to everything else in the book. <laughs> so, well, you see, I had the, uh, you see, I had this dream. I wanted to go hunting, so, uh, so I saved up my allowance and I got these traps. And we started hunting raccoons and we used something shiny. And then I decided, yeah, I want um, want a couple of dogs. And then I went uh, and, and 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 I saved up even longer and I got the dogs. And then we went out and got the dogs and uh, we brought the dogs back. They grew up and we started chopping down trees. Uh, and uh, then this happened and then that happened and over here and then uh, and then uh, one thing led to another and we ended up in a tournament which we lost. And uh, then we got uh, all the way over here and then another bunch of bullshit happened in that way over here. Uh, and yeah, that's when the dog dies and uh, yeah, that's where the red fern grows. <laughs> it's not a happy ending. This ship is a mess. It's got unitologists running all over it. It's got unitologists running it. We have five nodes. Let's upgrade something. Let's 
I'm going to die. I didn't see a single bench on the Valor. Did anyone else see a bench on the Valor? Because I didn't. Could do that. Hmm. Get some damage for the cutter. Bip, bip, bip. Big one right there. Ooh. Our magazine has gone has turned red. We also now have a hundred bullets instead of 70. Which will last us about three and a half reloads. Oh, hey. <laughs> Crew deck? On the tram tunnel. Vincent's rig. Wasn't that the last rig we need? Checking. We need Chief Engineer Rousseau. Somewhere in engineering. Fuck it. I'll go back. This shouldn't take long. Won't take long. We have the line. The Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Ba -ba -da -da -ba -da -ba. Ba ba da 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 ba da ba ba da 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 ba ba da da da. Mining engineering. So we go from the front of the ship to the back of the ship. Side. This side, apparently. It it okay, that was very confusing. <laughs> uh 
I don't know. <laughs> you couldn't appear with the rest of them? Had to make me waste ammo. Thanks, string bean. Didn't we pick up the chief's rig? Entering zero gravity. Wait a minute. I just realized something. We have to go through the loud room. Brace yourselves. Exiting zero gravity. This is the loud room. And I'm sorry to say, we might have to go back that way. Oh my god, she was behind a level 3 door. So we actually would have had to have come back here. Got her rig! Ugh! Me more than 25 bullets, friend. Engineering log. Chief Engineer Ariel Rousseau reporting. Hey, Ariel. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, I haven't slept right since they brought that marker on board. I'm a little, uh, uh, uh. The only thing I remember clearly is that engine inspection. I went into the chamber, and instead of the primary engine tower... Then I something, and when I look back, it was Entering zero gravity. gravity. But I can still hear that pumping in the distance. It's almost peaceful. Could that help me sleep? If I can get close enough. Yeah. Go right inside, maybe, where it's warm and dark. Yeah. That makes sense. Sleep right next to a running engine? Sounds kind of loud, lady. <coughs> yeah, we all have our comfort noises, I guess. There are certain sounds that when you hear them, it triggers a it triggers a calming reaction. For some of you, it may be something like a babbling brook. Maybe towels tumbling in the dryer. Apparently for her, it is the sound of a very loud running engine. Uh, to each their own. It's gross. I'm gross. Humans are gross. We are. We are inherently gross. Did you know? On the International Space Station, they still have to clean. It doesn't matter how much sterilizing and decontaminating and all that you do to a person prior to a rocket launch. 
Humans inherently produce bacteria. And that stuff builds up. So, they have cleaning day on the space station. They do this because on the Mir space station, the old Russian one, they removed a wall panel and there was just this giant globule of really nasty water that floated out when they pulled out that uh, when they pulled out that panel and they were like wow this is disgusting so from then on they started cleaning it cluster security override generated for Isaac Clark all access will be locked Fantastic. We've just given ourselves the key to the city. I am the captain now. Why is there a guide to unitology sitting here? Actually, you know what? Don't answer that. I think we know. The planet's gotten further away, though, so that's good. We're not gonna crash into it like we almost did. Uh, I'm just checking to see if they've dropped any trailers or, you know, if the show has even started. Uh, Persona 3 Reload. Is that how it's going to be this year, Game Awards? You're going to show off trailers for games that are getting remasters? Like The Last of Us Part 2? Isn't that game only three years old? Why is it getting a remaster? Oh, this is the service record. Okay. So, like, these are all the planets that she's ripped apart. Oh, wow, there was one in the soul system. Two, actually. Three! What the hell? Okay. Hang on. I, I think I actually want to look at this. <laughs> Titan got ripped apart. Phobos, they tore apart my... They tore apart my favorite moon. Vesta is gone. Pandora. Uh, Palace. Hygia. Lot of uh, moons. Varda. Ixion. Miranda is gone. So is Juno. Eunomia. Make Make. Gone. Ooh, Kepler. How SETI system? Even the Aura system. Ah, oh, Triton is gone? Oh, I love Triton. We all love Triton. Interesting little moon. Is that the one that's gonna slam into Neptune? Astronomical body Aegis 7. That's uh, that little planet out there. Oh, damn. 
This ship tore apart the solar system for a while, didn't it? Well, we knew Titan was gone because that was basically just a just a shard of what it once was in Dead Space 2. Still, though, I didn't know Ishimura was involved in that. <clears throat> Excuse me, I already came through here. Can't have you wrecking the vibe. What did I just say about vibes? But, uh, yeah, no, tr no interesting trailers yet for, uh, <coughs> the Game Awards. I think it's this way. Yes, yes it is. My bad, I went the wrong way. Plasma cut. Because we're probably gonna have to fight some unis. No, still empty, okay. Marker. There's a gym on board. Well, everyone needs exercise. <clears throat> Especially in space. They have a gym on the International Space Station. Folds out from the wall. Oh boy. Anyone else hear them singing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star? Well, time to start cleaning up. Ruining convergence for everybody. And the worst part is, they pull shit like this, and then they're like, No, we swear we're not a cult. This is a religion, not a cult. Anymore? Yeah. Well, 
that helps. It helps because I don't gotta kick him as many times. Oxygen tank. What the heck am I gonna do with that here? Zero G gym. Well, that defeats the purpose of uh, exercise to prevent muscle atrophy. But then again, artificial gravity is pretty much it. Get me under that. I don't care if you did your mass suicide in the shower. You can scrub, scrub, scrub till the water is brown. No amount of this water will wash away your shame. No amount of water is gonna wash away this blood either. It's a lot. Advanced engineer. Important. New suit. It costs sixty thousand dollars. Hold on. We're close to that. Yes! This is gonna leave us broke, but I don't care. New suit. Why does it look like the old one? <laughs> Let me see it. Uh, it's got that little thing up the top, I guess. This isn't your average everyday engineering rig. This is advanced engineering rank. Oh wait, there was stuff in the locker room. Level three locked doors cannot hold me anymore. I have got the mega key. Ha ha ha. Zero. Okay, Z ball rules. Use kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the rings before the timer runs out. Meeting each level yields a reward that can be claimed from the lockers. When the center of a ring lights up, target that ring for a score multiplier. Sport! Sport, 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 sport. Get that out of my way. Ugh. Level two. The most advanced level. No, it's not. 
Call my name? Minimal commentary because I'm focusing. Look, we're at level five. Why does the canned audience know my name? Maybe it's because the marker is nearby. These are all, uh... Flashbacks. Vietnam flashbacks to middle school when Isaac was on the basketball team. Ooh, I made that. Not giving me balls fast enough. Shit. No. I wanted three hundred. Reward locker now accessible. Congratulations. Basketball wasn't interesting enough. We had to put it in zero G. <sighs> Pulse rounds, kind of weird. Contact energy, also kind of weird. Force energy, kind of feels like you're just telling me to get back to work. Credits, that's more like it. Ruby semiconductor, a bit weird. Node. Okay, again, these are just things I can use at work. Sorry, Chief Engineer. So that's the Chief Engineer. <clears throat> yeah, because Jacob is just the acting Chief. I think he's said that on few occasions. Oh, hi! What? 
double ambush. That's not fair. Oh, wait, yeah, no. Worst part is, I knew you were faking it. What the? Oh, shit! I missed one! Oh, good news is he only had one. Okay. We're gonna save here. I'm gonna grab some food real quick. And I'm gonna stretch. Do a posture check as it were. And then we're gonna keep going. Sound good? Yeah, I think so. All right, be right back. God of War DLC. I mean, it's free, but you'd think they could try a little harder than that. You know what? Hang on, I, I just need to address something in the Discord real quick.
Just a minor concern. <laughs> Hi! Didn't see you there. How you doing? Well, I'm a little uncomfortable. Could you back up a tad? <laughs> I thought I had a master override. Why do I need a key to get in here? I have the key. The everything key. Temple is alive? Mercer! Still alive, Mr. Clark. Yeah. I'm still denied convergence thanks to this ingrate. Mercer, wait. Tell me. I want to understand. What is convergence? But you already know. No, I don't. Dead or living. We all feel the markers to the purpose. Don't you want to be reunited with the people you lost? I... No, because those losses make us who we are. Then why not it me? Mr. Temple has refused, but we are so close. Everything that has happened on this Shamora is just the beginning. When you put it that way, you and your marker can go to hell. Yeah! Shame. No! God damn it! And a slow death. I think your death will come faster. Fuck you! Tell me we're gonna get this guy! Alright, hang on. Gotta get in there. I gotta go past him. Close that door, close the door! that or can I Okay, let's try this. T. U.
are I think I know where this is going actual actually is it n it is n I'm guessing the next word is it That's an I. There's the T again. Turn it. Where's the O? Who's got it? O. F, F, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off, a very roundabout reference to Dead Space 3. where we did, indeed, have to turn it off. <clears throat> Hi guys, I'm just gonna... <coughs> I'm just not gonna... Actually, that might work. Well, we're, uh, according to the objective, we turned it off. I know what they're asking me to turn off, too. You're not gonna like it. What I'm crawly Oh god, there's two of you? God, you guys are disgusting! Sometimes the only thing that keeps you going is the thought of if, if I die, if I die, Mercer wins. We can't let Mercer win. Viper, you missed uh, 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 everything. Uh, a ship ran into us. Uh, Mercer killed Temple. Uh, Chen came back and uh, killed our captain. Oh, uh, we got rammed, rammed into by a, uh, by a battleship. Which reminds me of the time where... Basically a Coast Guard cutter from, uh, Venezuela got in an... Okay. The, the story was 
they were basically adrift because they were doing some maintenance, right? And they they must have drifted closer to, close enough to Venezuela that they thought it would be a concern. They thought they were smuggling drugs in. And so the Coast Guard was like, they were like, no, we can't have that. They're they're doing something illegal. So they sent a cutter over to start yelling at them. And they fired a couple warning shots, which went ignored for some reason that I'm not sure about. Personally, I would try to wave a white flag at this point. One thing led to another, and the guy captaining the cutter was like, I'm gonna ram them. So he did? But what he didn't realize was that this was a this was an arctic cruise ship designed to bounce off of icebergs so he rammed it and the cutter sank Was quite a jump there, fella. <laughs> oh, uh, the the cruise ship got away with uh, minor damage. Hey, I resent two of those things. What was the last strongest? The grief? Or the guilt? If this is therapy, it is not working. Yeah, we're, uh, getting messed with by Mercer right now. He's regenerating guys on the loose again, too, which is not fun. Looks like someone tried to barricade the standard quarters. Well, he didn't do that good of a job. I'm in. I don't need no... Damn kinesis. <laughs> Mr. X? Yeah, you can call him that. That's pretty fitting. Who said that? Oh god. Alright, hang on. Ah, there's two of yous. Disgusting. Hit him with an anti-tank rocket. Okay, I have seen the clips of that game. He does avoid those. <laughs> he pulls out the rocket... You pull out the rocket launcher in that game and he immediately turns around like, I'd like to apologize. <laughs> so honestly, that gave me an idea for that game. Why don't you just keep one rocket in the launcher and just have that as a deterrent? So that way, when he shows up, you just pull out the launcher and point it at him. Just 
keep one rocket in the launcher. Alright, now I might need the Kinesis. Oh, another thing you missed, Viper. We transmitted a Necromorph message. Anyway, it said turn it off. To who? To me. It was a it was a bunch of random gobbledygook. It was like new objective. Blah, 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 and I was like, I'ma translate that. And it said turn it off. Roundabout reference to uh, the events in Dead Space 3. We were supposed to break something in here. One second. Aha! Oh, he's here. Close that door! Close that door! Okay, so I cannot can kinesis your spit. Ooh, that was a good one. What was that, a large bed kit? Must have been. On me. Ah! I can feel my Isaac Clarkiness leaking out of my face. It's gross. It's gross. Yeah. <laughs> ah. Finally found a home for this thing. Hello, hey again. Hello, hey again. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Shall we see what the uh, trailers have been dropped? Uh. Darn. Nothing good yet. I don't think we're gonna have anything good, honestly. I have a wish list of trailers I'd like to see. But then again, game announcements have really dropped the ball this year. Game releases have been fucking amazing, but game announcements have been really lackluster. Wait, how did we just go in a big circle? I know why game announcements have been kind of... Okay. 
I know why game announcements have been kind of lacking this year. It's because we're in the middle of a lull. All the big games are coming out this year. We just did a whole big wave of really big games. Next year is when all the big announcements come out. That's when the storm hits. Teaser to Half-Life 2 Episode 2. Or Episode 3? No, they're not gonna do Half-Life 2 Episode 3. They're gonna do Half-Life 2 Episode 2... 2! The sequel to Half-Life 2 Episode 2. Half-Life 2 Episode 2 Part 2. You don't even play as, uh, you don't even play as Gordon in part two. You play as Barney. Whatever happened to Barney, by the way? We saw him at the end of episode one and then he just never showed up again. Plays Dave Half Life. Uh, no. You play as John Freeman, who is Gordon Freeman's brother. <laughs> he got a email that said aliens and monsters are attacking his place. <laughs> It is time for me to live up to my family name and face full life consequences. <laughs> John Freeman jumped in the air and did a Find the shuttle. You need to install the singularity core. Isaac. Isaac, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, but I'm not sure you could hear me. John Freeman jumped in the air and did a backflip. He grabbed his weapon. Weapon. <laughs> All right, you necro bastards. I got a new toy for you. It's called. The Doom Beam. I just used it all. Shit. Well, I got this too. <laughs> Should've bought med kits. Should have bought med kits. Tell you what, this store is right behind us. Let's go. <laughs> Why is it always John? <laughs> Why is that our go-to? <clears throat> it's like Genshin Impact. You play as John Impact, an inter an interdimensional being whose brother was eaten by Mega Bloks, <laughs> and is now forced to navigate Avatar: The Last Airbender for Weeaboos. Trapped in the realms of Gotcha Hell. You must face the native inhabitants of Twitter, space midgets, and the ice KGB. Whose sister was eaten? John Impact. <laughs> I 
That's what I named my other Sony account, by the way. I named it John Impact. <clears throat> because I accidentally screwed up, I needed another account for, uh... For my Genshin account so I could get Aloy. We realized that Aloy wasn't that good. What happened to you? Oh, you're alive. That's fantastic! A survivor! Found a survivor, guys! Alright, just... Excuse me, the body isn't even cold yet. We are... We are in the middle of a... We're in a morning period. Good sir. Rude. Wait, is that... Oh, sweet beam juice. <laughs> beam juice. <laughs> All right, let me just clean up loose ends in here. Uh, yeah. You look like you could go necro. Uh, you... Definitely necro material. Let me fix that. Can you imagine how angry they would be? But when we came in here, there was a room full of mass suicided uh, unitologists. And you know they. You know they took their own life so they could come back as necromorphs. You know that. And then some bastard with these giant boots comes along and just stomps all their limbs off. If you could be angry, you would be furious. Fortunately, they can't be angry. They're dead. I knew you were gonna get out. Oh, right. Where's that thingy? Wait a minute. Am I? Okay. Uh, Isaac. Sorry, late shift. How are you? I, um... My mother, she's, um... Octavia? How's she doing? How's she doing? <laughs> she's dead, Nicole. They both are. She killed my dad, then herself. church they uh, took the bodies before I could uh... oh my god oh Isaac I'm so sorry walking in told you stop brain. washing stop it just stop talking you said she was herself again you said she would be better at home. I trusted you. God. You might as well have killed him yourself. But she was better. Okay, that is you told way me out of line, you. Isaac. You, you pushed me to... You know what? Go to hell, Isaac. Isaac, it's me. 
wish I could talk to you. She wanted to talk. I didn't know. Sorry. I can make it right. I'm sorry. I can save us both. About everything. She she did want to talk. We have not burned that bridge yet. <laughs> Weapon upgrade. Force gun. <laughs> That's good, because we've been having fun with that. Whoa. Speak of the devil. Can't miss anything. This is cruelty. He was deciphering how the marker's signal affects the um. brain. Oh my god. Dr. Brennan. Let me guess. Terence Kine let you in. I think Kine let us Shame in. <clears throat> he didn't understand how this tragedy represents a chance to cure death. Go on. These creatures. Reanimated tissue. Cellular immortality. I, I know we've never seen eye to eye, but I understand now. There's so many I should have saved. Because you've learned how to communicate with the marker. I'm so close. I, I thought it must have the secrets that I need. Fantastic bluff. You're doing terrific. These are your autopsy notes. Very thorough. You'll need them peer-reviewed, of course. And poor Terence isn't here to help you. <clears throat> yes. There's only one man I trust now. It's me! Leave Harris alone. No related freak activity has been logged. Well, then I think we're at the end of that line. Darn. What's the contact beam secondary? Let's find out. Let's find out. Must have gotten someone's attention. Perfect! Uh -huh, okay. Oh, <laughs> used all of it! Used all of it! Oh my god, we gotta get away from here! Nope. So his skin grows back too? That ain't fair. Uh, for God's sake. Uh, uh. There's a pipe? I wonder if that would work. It might not. So... Objects like that are usually an insta-kill. Arm spikes will 
kill lurkers in one shot. The non-dark ones, at least. Ugh. It's dripping out my nose. Still got the runny, runny, run, run. Executive quarters. Anybody want to go visit the captain? Well, actually, truth told, we can't visit the captain. I shot him. My friends, is this what you hoped for when you signed your lives away to the church? Does this carnage look like transcendence? I don't know what lies beyond death. Not anymore. But I do know our lives are more than just fuel for convergence. If we work together, we can fight this evil. It's not too late. Please. Terrence, while I appreciate you finally coming to your senses and doubting the church, well, actually, he's been kind of on the fence this whole game. Killed the captain, by the way. Um, there is a realm of uh, benevolent evil so far beyond your understanding you cannot even imagine it, Terence. I have seen what's on the other side of the veil, and it is terrifying. We exist because they just haven't found us yet, and we will die if the veil is ever lifted. The Brethren Moons cometh. The Brethren Moons fucking cometh. Captain? 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 Whoa! Keeping secrets from me, are you, Captain? Captain? Captain! Which one's Benjamin? Is this Ben? No, he's a little too old to be Ben. I swear to God, motion blur is on. I keep. No, it isn't. It's the darnest thing, but I swear it is. <clears throat> Captain Benjamin Matthias. No, I don't think I will. Confidential. Captain Benjamin Matthias. Referencing our pre-departure discussion, I am blessed to report that the Vested have authorized a premium stasis capsule for you aboard the Church's Holy Fleet. Congratulations. There is a fleet? Your generous donations over the years have already 
covered all post-mortem stasis and cryopreservation fees because the Church of Unitology keeps, keeps possession of the body after they expire, which is fucking weird. While I cannot guarantee which arc will safeguard your physical body, all fleet vessels are designed for centuries of deep space operation and equipped with state-of-the-art defense technology, ensuring that convergence will proceed without interference when the holy hour approaches. I must reiterate that this birth is conditional upon the successful completion of your pilgrimage. Once the marker is safely delivered into church, into church hands, and all electronic records have been appropriately amended, I will be pleased to finalize your resting place amongst the church's most blessed, including Altman himself. Phoebe Tremaine, sanctified messenger, fleet selection and security. All correspondence to and from this individual is monitored. So there is a unitologist fleet. Fucking knew it. With the original games, we weren't we weren't entirely sure. But now. <coughs> oh boy. What is planet cracking? Planet cracking is quite literally the dismantling of planets and moons on a macro scale by dedicated vessels known as planet crackers. I will explain this in the fun terms. They go out and they just rip apart a planet. Just rip it apart with big giant spaceships like this one. Look, they've even got uh, samples from uh, previous planet cracks as little like souvenirs. Like, you want to talk about extreme resource consumption, you talk about the Dead Space Universe. Because at this point, humanity has reached a saturation point where resource consumption is so catastrophically bad, we need ships like this. Shit. Captain has been playing with Oijabort. That's disgusting! Cheap air vents. What's that? The key. Look at that pipe. If that guy shows up, we're gonna ventilate him. Here he comes. Wrong guy. I'll tell you what, though. <laughs> They did send one of these little dudes. <laughs> Came in here looking for corpses. Found none. Arm boys. Where's that pipe? Boring, you didn't even send the big guy. He did give me more beam juice. Favorite murder drones character? I don't care. 
I haven't watched enough of that show to establish a favorite. Also, aren't there only like four episodes? That group does the. That group does great work, but they don't make stuff very fast. Ooh. Second officer. Very nice. This is awfully luxurious for a mining ship. Excessively decadent. I'm afraid I might get gout just by standing in here. Everyone else is sleeping in bunks. The ship is enormous. We can't get our own rooms? Infidels. Yeah, those bunks are for the infidels. Goddamn unis are running the ship. Okay, so the first officer isn't in on it. So far, I know for sure. Captain Matthias, Kine, Mercer, Lieutenant Commander Holt, Carrillo, Pitts, Reed, Maynard, Shand, Espel Espelita, Nativity. That many senior officers just happen to be marker heads? Can't be a coincidence. I know it's stacked deck when I see one. Update, check some files. A lot of those reassignments started after Director Egghart. Eckhart got chatty with the captain. Since when does the C-suite give a damn about personnel? When there are rumors that a marker is involved? It's a very interesting religion, bound, like, founded in the basis of almost science, I would say. Like, Altman found the marker in Australia and started, uh, and started, uh, preaching about it. Um, but because it, it was an alien artifact, that is true, that is not false. It wasn't this one, by the way. It wasn't this marker. But it is a happy little coincidence that it showed up in time for this lecture. So, yeah, he starts preaching about it. Government shows up, starts covering all of that up, and then he starts making a religion about it. A pseudo-religion. He kind of calls it a religion because that's more or less the best means of recruitment. And it spreads like fucking wildfire. Why did the government try to cover it up? It's powerful alien technology. As far as I can tell, EarthGov wants that power. Or at least they did in Dead Space 2. But another reason they probably covered it up is because, uh, it's a cult. The cultiest religion I've ever seen, honestly. And Christianity led to a lot of cults. Whoa. Hey. Remember, we spoke on the valley. You're real. Let me in. 
I need to destroy that cluster behind you. Not yet. Not, if, escape on that shuttle and you'll kill us all. When they took the marker from Aegis 7, they woke the being in the core of the planet. Okay. The hell is that? Mercer calls it the hive mind, the nexus organism which controls these necromorphs telepathically. If we leave while the hive mind is active, well, you saw valor. If even a single necromorph escapes, humanity is finished. She told me it would return the beast to its slumber. Okay, so if we return the marker to Aegis 7, it'll stop the outbreak? Exactly. But we need the shuttle to return it to the planet. You have a singularity core, and I can let you through. So what do you say? If it'll end this for good, deal. Excellent. Okay. I, I, I can distract Mercer, but not for long. Get the marker to the shuttle bay quickly. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Mark. We're teaming up with Terrence. By the way, Terrence sounded a lot creepier in the original game. It's one of the few good unis. Yeah, it's like... It's like Republicans. They're not all bad. Like, uh... What was his name? John McCain. McCain, he's dead now, but... If he had won the election in 2008, I wholeheartedly believe we would have been absolutely fine. Like, he could have done it. Perhaps there's been some kind of accident. Some severance? Does the marker in the hive mind always coordinate, or can the hive mind slip the marker's influence somehow? Yes, Amelia, there are always alternate solutions. Always. He's talking to his dead girlfriend. Reagan was best. Reagan was cool. That was a cool guy. God, that guy was a fucking boss. <laughs> you want to talk about some of my favorite, uh, favorite presidents, uh, Abraham Lincoln was a Republican, guys. And he was he was one of the greatest ever. <laughs> and I'm just double checking right now. Was Roosevelt a Republican? It doesn't say. No, no, it says right here, he was a Republican. Teddy Roosevelt was a Republican, and he was fucking awesome. <laughs> Teddy Roosevelt was like the cool uncle that you never got to see on the weekends. <laughs> that man hunted bears. <laughs> That man went to war with Cuba and won. <laughs> I 
Uh, hmm. Gonna... He finished a speech after he was shot. He did finish a speech after he was shot. Yes. Oh my god. That's better, isn't it? Talk about both sides both sides of the aisle, you blue haired fucker. <laughs> God. Teddy Roosevelt. But there's one thing about Teddy that's gotta suck. The year and the era that he lived in. Because they were misogynistic as hell. All of them. That was back when, uh, men dominated and were like, women should be kept in different rooms and all that. So that's one part that's gotta suck. <laughs> of the USPP. Hey. Vote for you. Vote for who you want. I'm not gonna stop you. Voting is a choice, and it's your choice. So long as you know that with that choice, it is a civic responsibility. What I'm saying is, don't vote for Harambe. Please! <laughs> I asked nice. <laughs> oh, God. Alright. I gotta go to work here. This is my job. This is my work. Chopping people up. Why are you red? I got a fan! It's your biggest fan! Ooh, that guy is airborne. And so is he! No, he's not. Ow! How'd you get over here? Ooh! That was your own fault. <laughs> that guy, he jumped. I just threw a credit chip at him. <laughs> Quarantine lifted. It's funny we're talking about Roosevelt. Because I, I was talking with uh, one of my co workers about, um,. Ernest Hemingway. I forget how we got on Hemingway, old Hemmers. But the, but his question was, name any Ernest Hemingway book besides, I don't know, so-and-so. I forget the name of it. To which I said, for who the bell tolls. And I knew that because I actually knew about Ernest Hemingway. I knew about Ernest Hemingway because of all the insane shit he's done. He enlisted with the American Red Cross during World War I, got blown up in Milan. Ah, uh, you have it. Now install the Singularity Core on the shuttle. I'll come help you load the marker. Hurry. Ended up in hospital for a while, fell in love with a nurse, they decided to get married, he went home to get ready for that, she left him for an Italian soldier, which led to a lifelong pattern of him rejecting women before they could reject him. 
there's at least three instances of him cheating on his wife, getting divorced, and marrying the other woman. He shot himself in the leg while aiming at a shark. Uh, went to Africa to shoot a bunch of animals and got dysentery, karma. Became the self-appointed leader for a band of freedom fighters outside of Paris. Was subsequently brought up on charges for violating the Geneva Convention and got away with it. Spent a bit of the war in Cuba on his boat, tracking Nazi submarines with nothing but a machine gun and a pile of hand grenades. I am not making this up. <laughs> These are the real adventures of Ernest Hemingway. Got clawed in the face while playing with a lion. Cheated on his wife, got divorced, married the other woman. Left a bunch of stuff in a safe in Cuba and fled to Idaho, paranoid that the feds were after him. Which they were, because he spent most of the 1940s working for the KGB! <laughs> Again, not making this up. Was nominated for a Pulitzer Prize. Had a file opened on him by J. Edgar Hoover. Got committed, received way too much electroconvulsion therapy and came out all screwed up. Started hit to get suicide. So he immediately got recommitted. Um where he received two more weeks of electroconvulsion therapy, got released, put both barrels of his favorite 12-gauge shotgun down his throat, and blew his own head off. That's Roosevelt. That's Ernest Hemingway, the writer, who did all this stuff and still found the time to write around 15 books. Singularity core replaced. Test fire shuttle engines to complete hardware installation. By the way, uh, we found the shuttle. It's ugly. It's almost as ugly as the ship in, um... Lethal Company. By the way, that is a thing I've been meaning to say. Lethal Company has one of the ugliest ships I've ever seen. Woohoo! Yeah, pretty good. Oh, oh, oh shit. Where'd you come from? Oh my god, you're not dead? We don't call that resilience, we call it annoying. I didn't know your name was Nane and I thought your name was like Hunter Buford. Buford? <laughs> Did you get Buford? <laughs> oh, my God! Oh my god! Ah! 
my god, Mom, I am on fire! <laughs> it doesn't stop! Got sticks for arms? He's got stick arms! Give it a pull. Okay, to answer the earlier question, the pull, or any stabby bit for that matter, just bounces off this guy. I've got an idea as to how we can get rid of him once and for all, though. Little known fact about a rocket engine is in a pinch. You can use one as an incinerator. If you absolutely had to. Oh shit! Yeah, fuck you too! <laughs> I'm not sorry about that. Oh shit. Oh, here we go. Oh, round and round and round we go. Where we stop, nobody may know. Uh, uh, hang on, I got a gun. Uh, it's a gun. Come on, come on, come on! Uh, 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 the hole was right there, too. Do you read me? Mr. Clark! Mr. Clark, come in! Fuck this ship! Yeah! Altman, be fuck Altman, too. Yeah, fuck that guy, too. Uh, yeah, but every alert on the Ishimura is screaming. Critical damage to internal systems. The marker just ripped right through the ship. Something pulled it down to the cargo bay. Jesus Christ. Pilot the shuttle to the hangar. I'm going after the marker. Of course. Amelia, quickly. Wait, Dr. Kine. That guy's lost it. He killed the captain. I know. Near the marker. He says returning it to the planet is the only way to end this. We've got to try. I'm heading to cargo. You ping Nicole's rig and tell her where to go. Leave it to me. Thanks. When I get the marker, we're all getting out of here. Okay. Not that I was done looting that room, but okay. This is convergence. When do we get con when do we get to convergence? This is convergence. Yippee! <laughs> Cryogenics, huh? Kinda sucks having played the first game and already knowing the story. No, no, I disagree wholeheartedly. I believe that it is a great examination of how far we've come. It's a it's almost a redemption arc for EA as a company. To give Dead Space the attention it deserves. To give us the game that we want. We've been chomping at the bit for more Dead Space. I can only hope that they'll do the same thing for Command and Conquer. And I got the Buford name from Angry Grandpa. Sorry if that was weird. No, it wasn't weird. It was funny. 
if I don't stand near that. It was funny. <laughs> Pewfer. <laughs> hey, uh, it's, uh, it's me, your favorite internet personality is Buford. <laughs> and today we're playing uh, Dead Space. <laughs> Mr. Clark, we're approaching the hangar bay. We'll meet you there with the marker. Yes, and I guess soon. We'll send the hive mind back into the darkness. I know, I, I know. That guy our only escape shuttle. <laughs> Shit, Isaac. Yeah? Those things you've killed, their biomass has pulled down in the cargo bay. It's recombined itself into... Well, it's something huge, and the marker's embedded right in the middle. How the hell do we do this? I've got the Shimmer's cargo cranes. They can move half a bay of mining gear, no problem. If whatever's down there wants to wrestle for the marker, I'm in. Override the safeties, and yes, it might work. But hurry, we're losing critical systems fast. Sure, Kendra. Hang on. We're never going upstairs again, so... That's a dumb name. No, Matt's, a, Matt's an okay name. I was supposed to plug that in over there, wasn't I? We were just supposed to redo the circuit breaker. Doors, please! No elevators. No, that's fine. <coughs> I'm okay, really. Stop giving me ammunition capacity. I just got off playing Zelda. Which one? Breath of the Wild 2, Tears of the Boogaloo? I've fallen back into that recently. I realized that, oh, I never actually finished this. Maybe I should. So I'm gonna be doing more of that tonight while, uh, we rendered dungeons and door kits. Hyrule Warriors! All personnel proceed to your designated safe zone immediately. Emergency. Internal hull breaches detected. What's an internal hull breach? As someone who works on a spaceship, I should probably know that. Is that just like a hole between two rooms? <laughs> Haven't yet gotten the new one, but it's on my list. Oh, which one? Breath of the Wild 2, Tears of the Boogaloo? Did I ever tell you how that stream got named? I was at PAX East with my cousin, and we got talking about uh, Tears of the Kingdom, and he called it Breath of the Wild 2 Tears of the Boogaloo. And I told him, you know what, I'm stealing that, uh, that the stream is going to be named Breath of the Wild 2 Tears of the Boogaloo. Alright, someone's got to pick an upgrade. Do we want pulse rifle upgrade or do we want plasma cutter upgrade? Because those are the only two we can afford. Make your decision now.
Okay, plasma cutter was, uh, said first. I'm also gonna buy a med pack. <clears throat> I think we were closer to the pulse rifle, but... Very well. Oh, you know what I should check? See if there are any new trailers. Well, there's a trailer for Rise of the Ronin, which is notably not Ghost of Tsushima 2, which is what I asked for. And a game called Jurassic Park Survival. I don't think we're getting Titanfall 3. Because if they're... If they're dropping trailers for Rise of the Ronin, they're probably not going to drop trailers for Ghost of Tsushima 2. Which means our... Titanfall 3 is our last hope. Unless something crazy happens and they announce something... Something awesome besides that. You heard the lady, get to your get to your safe zone. Please note the bathroom is not a safe zone. That didn't scare me, I just rounded the corner a little too quickly. Hello again. Let me just get that out of the way. Got some good range on this. Well, let's have a look at that plasma cutter upgrade. Oh god, it's miles away. Why didn't we predict this? All right. What does it do? Applies damage over time to each shot. That's actually good. Hey, buddy, what happened to you? Let me just get rid of those limbs of yours. Very good. Okay, you can't just put it in a locker. And... You can't just put Peng in a locker. Okay, you have to hide it. That's what all the other games did. Hoping to get this for PS5? It should. It's very good. This is one of the best games this year. This is why it's insulting that it wasn't up at the Game Awards. Absolutely insulting. Force gun. Frankly, I, as a Dead Space fan, I am very offended. Oh, for God's sake, just... Oh, you're one of those, huh? Fine. Fine by me. <laughs> I do am offended by a Dead Space fan. Yeah, I'm really hope that actually they were talking about redoing Dead Space 2 and I'm really hoping 
that uh, EA gives them the green light, which they might actually give them the green light to do that. EA has been good lately. They haven't been tremendously heavy on the microtransaction. They've been trying to win some goodwill. They put their entire catalog on Steam. And to my infinite surprise, they have not killed Bioware. Which I like Bioware, so th so that is an absolute win. I think people finally complained enough. I believe it was, um... I believe it was they who created the straw that broke the camel's back, as it were. Star Wars Battlefront EA 2. The proverbial final nail in the coffin. This was the game where players finally threw up their arms and said, I've had enough. I've had enough. The Force Unleashed should be remade. Okay. If you're gonna do that, you remake the Force Unleashed. It, it, absolutely. You can just go ahead and do that. But please, for the love of God, completely rework the second one. Please. God, you can beat that game in three hours. But we could sit down and beat that in one stream. Safety. Now you want to talk to me about safety. Ah, <sighs> we got it. <clears throat> and my vision starts going on wibble when I can stand near that thing. <laughs> Feeling kind of good today, did something awesome. What'd you do, Mecha Wolf? I've been feeling pretty good lately, too. Share the good news, share the love. What do you got? <laughs> Caution. Is I really wish you would just tear yourself open and get it over with. I like their spikes, though. They got the big spikes. <laughs> what? Caution. No one else? Access bridge is obstructing transfer. Move this dumb anti-scald value from the shower at home. Oh, scald value. Ah! Okay, so you remove the temperature limiter from the shower, which is always... Always good. <sighs> so yeah, anti-scald valves. Yeah, you gotta get rid of those. Because at... Everyone knows only 10% of time in the shower is spent getting clean. The other 90% of the time is just mm, hot water. Search your feelings, you know it to be true.
<laughs> it really is, though. Especially in winter, too. again real quick I'm trying to do that as little as possible so that the stream doesn't get too interrupted Ugh, that was a messy one uh, is it gonna be able to get over that gross Speaking of gross, this guy. He's gross. There's a gross guy behind me! Ah, two grosses! I have an idea. God, crowd control! I need crowd control! Fuck! Access bridge is obstructing the transfer. No, I did not see Phantom of the Opera. Shit, I missed. Ah! Transfer. 30 enemies with the line gun. Shows you how much I actually use the line gun. Crowd control to Major Tom. Dude, I'm dying here. Access bridge is obstructing transfer. <clears throat> and now I'm out of med packs. Or dudes. <sighs> no. Contact energy. I'm reading a cargo transfer to the hangar bay. The marker. Good work, Mr. Clark. On our way. Kine, your flight path goes by airlock 19. I can get there from the computer core. Pickup. Yes, we'll be there. Did you make it to the airlock alone? No movement on the cameras. I I'm just gonna run for it. Wish me luck. Okay, Kendra, good luck. <sighs> My brain does dumb things. Hey, all of our brains do dumb things. It's like, uh... I feel like it's like Scrobbles. You know, la that website, Last FM. They don't. They don't call them plays. They call them scrabbles. Hold on. Fucker lured me off the mining deck to build something to make his markers start converging. I don't know. Liz, if you find this, don't touch that marker. And if you see Mercer, run. I love you. But after David, I never imagined. I... Fuck, he's coming back. Time to go, Mr. Temple. You can just leave your force gun here. If you want me to build your shit, I'll need it. But you won't need these modifications, will you? They look like they could hurt someone. I'll hold on to them. There. Now the marker. You can go ahead of me, Mr. Temple. Safety first. I haven't heard that one. But anyway, yeah, scrabbles. You know how when uh, your brain kind of scrambles, but your mouth keeps saying stuff, and you snap back into reality and you have no idea what you just said? I think that just happened during a meeting where instead of, where instead of subscribers, he just said scrabblers. And they were like, did he just say scrabblers? Just write it down. <laughs> Oh, 
Scrubblers! Kids are going crazy for these scrubblers! Scrubblers! <laughs> Alright, I'll stop. I didn't know Temple had a modified force gun. Fuck, it's my brother. On the monitor, he's right by the airlock. Don't let this place get to you. Kendra, we're out of time. I... He's not there. I can make it if I run. Th th then run! Fuck! Bush. Gonna lock me in this room with someone again? I got a fan blade! There it is! Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. God, it's Speedy Gonzales. Stick them with the sharp end. I need space! Oh shit. Is that a reference to M. Night Shyamalan's movie Signs? Where the aliens all died from water? Water. Also known as the most abundant substance in the universe. Water. Man, that is an ugly ship. Look at that thing. But it'll get us out of here. I can't run the automated loading controls. Must be the damage to the ship. We're losing time. The hive mind is down there. Kind, relax. I'll turn off the gravity in the hangar, and I can load the marker by hand. All right. No, don't worry, Amelia. They understand. Jesus. Relax, once we get the marker in place, he'll stop talking to his dead girlfriend. 
Or uh, maybe the marker will stop talking to him. Entering zero gravity. Diamond semiconductor. Valuable. I think that's worth about 10,000 creds right there. Let's go for a couple med packs, which we desperately need. Let's see here. Uh, close this. Turn on the train tracks. Oh my god! Finally! Ugh, that... You know when you think you're gonna sneeze and then you don't? That's been my entire day. Well, hello. <laughs> Ooh, big one. Yes, that'll help. Dumb phone won't adjust to a higher quality. Well, we're only in 720. Oh, right. Uh, condolences to uh, all the Twitch streamers in South Korea. I heard what's happening, that sucks. Stuck on fourteen four. Uh, that is a bit odd, actually. Good. All right, it's moving, it's schmoving, moving, schmoving, and grooving. use this thing more. <laughs> Fixed it. Nice. I'm just gonna throw bombs at you. What the fuck? This little runt survived two bombs. What is that? Is that the new? Co yeah, this is the new contact beam. It now fires a. It now fires a devastating beam of death. It's alt fire is the original, is the original charge shot. Not so good, not so good. There it is, the marker. The safeties are still on. I need to restore gravity before we can load it. Hurry, please. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting no turns, don't worry. Turn the gravity back on, and we'll... And we'll all take a ride... Down to the planet. And we're gonna... Bash the hive mind with this thing. Gotta bash the guy on the head with it. 
<laughs> That's dead space lore right there. Exiting zero gravity. <laughs> it's on board. Come quickly. Go open the hatch for him. Hey, Terrence! Yeah, but what about- I Hi. Hi! So what, this is your sudden but inevitable betrayal? Oh, you sorry. I couldn't trust him with the marker. Kendra, what are you doing? What my department sent me here to do. Even if the Valor couldn't help me out like I wanted. Department? Who are you? I work for EarthGov, cleaning up a very, very old mess. I told you and Hammond that Aegis 7 was off limits. The planet was one big government experiment. The marker, this divine artifact, it was built by human hands. That's impossible. It's an alien world. The miners dug up the fucking thing. After it was planted here a few hundred years ago. Even Kai didn't pick up on that. What year is it? They found the first marker in some crater on Earth. That one. That was real. Alien. Enough to inspire unitology. Our people studied it and reverse engineered this red marker. But... They needed somewhere to test it. Aegis 7. You've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. I thought the old reports were just hysteria. Until I saw what I saw. They sealed off the whole system, buried the records nice and clean. Until CEC got greedy. Those idiots tore Aegis 7 apart and woke up with the old research team left behind. So EarthGov sent you to sweep it all under the rug. Damn it, we have to return the marker. If anyone else stumbles across each seven... It was disappeared once. We can do it again. I've seen how the marker fucks with your head. It must be contained. For what it's worth, we made a great team. You hid in a closet! You'll find another way off the Ishimura. I mean... You're one hell of an engineer. Your experiment's gonna kill us all! Daniels! That was our last ship. It was all for nothing. <clears throat> uh -huh. Isaac, come in, it's Nicole. Where are you? In the flight control room. Please, you have to come up here now. There's still a way out for us, but we don't have much time. Daniels. I'm gonna kill you. Killed it, I'll kill again. I'm Isaac Lark, motherfucker. <clears throat> Ugh. That can't be good. Nicole! There you are. I got you here. The ship's coming apart. I saw what you've been through. Your investigation, Mercer. What happened with us? We don't have to talk about it. I need you to know I'm sorry about everything. It's okay, Isaac. You know I forgive you. I won't be able to. Well, good, but... I still hope. <laughs> you can recall the shuttle and remote pilot from here. Bring back the marker and we can return it to Aegis 7. We can make this whole again. I just want to make things right. The 
and let's do it together. Alright. Let's get her back here. Recalling shuttle USG-09. Prepping remote docking procedures. Damn it, Isaac. You don't know what you're doing. I know. I'm finally doing the smart thing. Fucking kidding me. Shit! <laughs> Escape pod launch detected from shuttle USG-09. Escape pod. Damn! We lost her. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. But who can? I can. Program the shuttle with our flight path to Aegis 7 and join you on Well, that's what uh, that's a roundabout way of saying uh, if you get on that shuttle, you go to the end game. Never again. <laughs> yeah, this is like your last chance to wrap up all your side quests, which we did. Not getting in my way. Then I get on that shuttle. I've gotta be a wizard. I've gotta do spells. Gotta get an owl to deliver my shitty mail. And I'm gonna be a wizard. If you're a society of wizards that has ready access to teleportation, why are they having their mail delivered by nature's slowest bird? Oh boy. Why did you use the big one? I wanted to use the two small ones! Shit. <coughs> the owls formed a union? <laughs> you know, it goes deeper than just the owls, you know. If you're a... Like... If we're going deep into the whole wizard wizardry secrets and uh, society thing, Hogwarts is the Illuminati. <laughs> and if you're so smart, why aren't you helming society into a brighter future? And even if you're not, you're just allowing the atrocities of the world to happen? <laughs> J.K. Rowling did not write a masterpiece. She wrote Star Wars with sucky lightsabers. I never doubted you, Isaac. I knew you'd come back. Are you ready? Awfully weird keyboard layout. This isn't how I imagined saying goodbye to the Ishimura. Steady. I'm good. 
No, I'm not. I'm drunk at the wheel. No. With you, I can handle anything. Did we have control over the atrocities of our politicians? The wizards should. Ride together. <laughs> this all began in the core of the planet. Daniel said EarthGov built the marker. Some experiment they abandoned hundreds of years ago. That's one hell of a thing to abandon. If you're not ready, the miracle must be as terrifying as a nightmare. The planet is restless, hungry. It'll try to eat us alive. But we have the marker. We'll put things back the way they were. We will be whole. So is that the marker making you talk stupid, or is that just you all the time? Just saying. All right, alternate solutions. Ugh, that's a view. Pushing me. The, to the, <laughs> the loading track leads directly to the excavation site. It'll work. The hive mind will obey. We'll be whole again. And you and I can be together. I mean, we're together now. Let's Come go. On. We need to hurry. I mean, why do we have to put the marker on the pedestal? All, he, all, all kind said was that we have to bring the marker back to the planet. Marker on planet, let's go. <laughs> We're done. This isn't hard. Just marker on planet. these rituals I gotta have procedures you gotta wear the right clothes you gotta say the right incantations <laughs> Captain Benjamin Matthias retrieve victims of Union Square mass suicide from Aegis 7 Bodies are to be transported to USG Ishimura Morgue with security escort. Notify Dumas and Kine upon arrival. Yeah, I know. It's casket duty, but I think you'll like this one. I hear a buddy of yours is down on Aegis 7, and a kitty assignment like this should leave time for a meetup. Don't scare the rookie. Mind. It's worth twenty five thousand. Even better. On top of the ping we just sold, which was thirty thousand. We're sitting a lot of cash right now. I'm gonna buy this.
That just gave us six nodes. Let's upgrade some stuff. Shit. Wrong one. Well, actually, I think we can still make it. What does it do? Greatly increased rate of fire. That's boring. Well, I'll get the heat accumulator and a little bit of damage. And more damage. Is the last pulse rifle upgrade in the shop? Because I will buy it. Ripper, flamethrower, contact beam, line gun, force gun. No, it's not here. I'm gonna buy med kits. Quite a few med kits. extra damage on the line gun. We're getting some use out of it. Oh, great. Oh, you just upgraded all your equipment? Good! Now use it. Fucking damn... Where is he? Fun time. This is Sergeant Bram Newman. P sec evacuation report. The shuttle's gone. Took off and then crashed right back down into the bay. Jesus! Took a whole crowd with it. Must be a hundred people dead. We've lost the rest of the shuttles. God help us. There's no way out. Anyone hearing this, do not land. I repeat, do not land on Aegis 7. Fuck the Ishimura. They left us to die. <laughs> well done, Benjamin. You screwed us all. Oh, but we got the marker. No, you didn't even get that because now I have the marker. There it is. Nya, 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 nya. I took your marker. <laughs> what are you doing with that, Mr. Clark? Give that back. No, Benjamin Matthias. I don't think I will. hitting the reload button and nothing happening. My god, it's finally empty. Oh 
Okay, guess we're not going that way. There you are. Yeah, give me them boxes too. I'm gonna need this ammo. Now, I thought there was a... Going on about Fallout in the Game Awards and there's a guy in a real suit of Fallout power armor. I don't mind people telling me about the trailers, but just please don't mention any of the awards. Because they're probably going to the wrong games. Have they announced anything good? Blade. New trailer for the Fallout show. I already saw a trailer for the Fallout show. How could there be a new trailer for the Fallout show if they just dropped one this past week? No. Literally five days ago. It's a payday like one, except it's in a futuristic setting. Hang on. Why is caps lock always on with this fucking keyboard? Oh, and the model's broken. Uh, give me one sec. I gotta stop tabbing out of the game. That's what screws us up. We've been going great so far. Let me calibrate that, actually. Okay. Much better. Okay. Let's try not to tab out. Let's try to finish. I could probably translate that. show you a quarantine and I ain't talking COVID here. This is the new plasma cutter. It does damage over time now. Which means everybody's about to get some pain. Move. Deal. I'll deal with you. I'm dealing with you. 
Oh boy, here we go. Nope, he's dead. Never mind. That guy ended up on the ceiling. Bad, bad. I don't have a force gun. Oh shit. They said war never changes in the new Fallout trailer. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Because apparently, what they have done is they have dropped two trailers. Um, no, that's a Fallout 76 from five years ago. I am, I do not care how, yeah, no, I am not watching the actual show. <laughs> uh, so I played the last hour, I guess. It's 40 seconds. You guys want to watch? Here, hang on. It's not going to be large, and I'm also going to lower the volume. Wait, no. I don't need browser source. I need window source. I did say if there was an interesting trailer, we would stop what we were doing and go watch it. Well, something happened. I was hoping for Titanfall 3 or something like that, but I'll take a fallout. <laughs> All right. It's only 40 seconds, so. Like the frame rate terrible. What is happening? Hang on. Try again. Yeah, see, we've seen all of these shots. We've seen the, the dog, we've seen the Pridwin. We've seen that shot. I don't think we saw that shot. We have seen that shot. War never changes. Okay, they said it. I don't get it. Like, we've seen all of that, actually. All of those shots were in the trailer that came out five days ago. They, they just didn't say war never... Ch they did not say war never changes in the trailer five days ago. But, yeah, okay, I'll have to put out an update somehow. Being like, okay, guys, I know in our React video I said, if they do not say war never changes, I'm done. And, uh, yeah, they said it. <sighs> All right. All right, we're still in combat, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very happy. We should do this every year. We should have this party every year. 
The non the non game awards stream. That's everything. NCR flag. Dude, the NCR flag is just the California flag, but with an extra head of a bear. California doesn't even have that good of a state flag. are still pretty bad. <clears throat> Why didn't you just drag it through the whole room? Contact energy. stuff over there. Well, I think we should grab it. Force energy, absolutely. Yes. Not that was a box. California did have a Lone Star flag. I can sense no power in this section. The marker won't move. We're losing time. It's okay. Hit test connection. What's it say? Power failure detected. Tether generator. Gravity control. One of the ground side gravity tethers. Maybe a busted power line. I'm on it. Please hurry. We can't fail now. Okay. <laughs> Ah, oh, great. Well, let's see how this does. I like the force gun much better. Hang on. Let me load it. explosives uh, force gun is much more effective why waste perfectly good explosives I do want to buy some force gun ammo though don't know why it isn't an option. Alright, fine. I will buy this. And 
no sneeze. Okay. The dog is here. Okay, let's have a look. Warning. Main power interrupted. Tether generators are offline. All right, hold your horses. So head down and have a look. you're looking for hmm there's no food in here no no food at all no no food at all oh no I'm so hungry everybody's so mean to her because nobody feeds her even though i totally did feed you that is a thing <laughs> Okay, well, I really want to finish because we're right at the end. Basically, yeah. Seriously, it's the final level. Alright, uh. Core number one. Power restored to East Generator. Uh, kill the elevator. Emergency elevator offline. Notifying maintenance. I am maintenance. Power restored to West Generator. Power restored to Tether Generators. Ready for restart. Fantastic. Restarting Tether. Now entering zero gravity. Why? Jenna Isaac, power is flowing again. Pikmin Molt 4, one best strategy. Shan, don't tell me who wins. Seriously, don't tell me who wins because they're probably giving the award to the wrong game. Just like every year. Every year they screw it up. Wait, there's still a thing. Oh, wait. Let's see if that does it. <clears throat> if there's a cool trailer, that yeah, you can tell me if there's a cool trailer. In fact, I encourage that. I just don't want to hear about, oh, this game won, or that game did a thing. Because it's a shit show. I don't respect the, I don't respect the game awards, not anymore. I don't know if I ever did. Exiting 
Zero gravity. Not since the year Fallout 4 absolutely kicked ass and then they gave game of the year to somebody else. Boy, howdy, they picked a real bunch of smart asses to give, uh... Copies of, uh... Fallout 4 to. You guys need to stop backing me into corners. And doing that. Stop doing that. I'm working on it. In your damn arms. blow up. His arm is there. Yeah, because one spike wasn't enough to kill you. <sighs> Transport the marker through storage container. <laughs> Let's put the fork in the garbage disposal. Let's put the fork in the garbage disposal. Tick 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 tick. Security card. Three notes. Very nice. Are we going to see the head of the Gaming Awards? Yes, absolutely. Starfield already won Game of the Year, but we're going to give it a run. We're going to do a runner-up award. Because it, it's not even a fair fight. <laughs> it's not even close. <laughs> I will say this, though. Competition for best horror game this year? Fierce. Alan Wake 2, this game. An underdog, Lethal Company. Hello Games revealed a new game. Wait, what? Okay, that's actually big. D did he say what it is? Or did he just say, hey, it's me. It's me, Sean. Sean Hello Games. And I'm working on a new game. What's it called? Cuber! <laughs> been to California? Yes, when they were still doing E3, but I haven't been since. It's called Light No Fire. Problems again. Okay, hang on. Uh, 
Okay, now Streamlabs is completely unresponsive. We're probably going to get a stream crash here in a second. Capture still works, though. Let me fix the model. Hang on. Since I can't get to the BRB screen... E3 at Los Angeles Convention Center and everybody hated it for some reason despite the fact that all of your game reveals and trailers and all of that were in one convenient place E3. It was convenient. E3 was convenient. Ah, here we go. Stairs. Who said that? Clearly a necromorph, okay. How much damage over time because I'm having to dispense the same amount of bullets. New trailer is two minutes. Uh, yes, but I can't get Streamlabs to work. And every time I tab out of this game, the stream gets very unpredictable and unstable. Oh. Hey, hey pal. Oh, don't worry, he's harmless. Harmless enough. I think there's a store all the way at the end, right before the boss, so that's probably what that's for. Sorry, I stopped to blow my nose. Again, it's a problem. Winchester Mystery House. Sounds 
very tourist trap, not gonna lie. <laughs> not gonna lie, that sounds very tourist trap. Okay, good news. I think this is the last door. Yes, it is. You're almost there, Isaac. Get the marker to the pedestal. Hurry! Pedestal's over there. <laughs> Okay. Pedestal time. Pedestal time. Nailed it. I'm seeing a lot of contact energy out here. Give me one second. So that cleared this, I think. It's gotta be somewhere around here we could get an angle on another one. <clears throat> Ooh, wait. I see it. Why aren't I at the Game Awards? Uh, because I hate them. I don't respect, uh, their... I don't respect them, and I don't respect the awards I give out. Because they usually get it wrong. They also didn't nominate Starfield. They didn't... They did nominate Blizzard after they fired all their support staff. They also gave Game of the Year to Overwatch that one year. And that one year where The Last of Us Part Two won everything. So we're gonna finish Dead Space. A real video game. Yes, this. This is a real video game. Please, Isaac! The high mind is coming! You have to make us whole! I'm working on it! Do you want to come down here and do this? Because breaking this hole is actually really hard to do. I don't have time for a fucking text log. Ah shit, this might kill me. Fucking move. You mean Team Fortress 2's clone? Yes. They gave that thing game of the year. Oh my god, I'm out.
I think they're finally done. Because he's not interested in the Game Awards? Oh, I am interested. Interested in exposing them for the garbage that they are. And the fact that they get it wrong every single year. Where's the button? It's over here. No. Why don't you host the Game Awards? We do. It's called the Head Editor Gaming Awards. Brought to you by Head Editor Gaming, our gaming channel. I really needed that. I needed that explosive. I've covered in so much blood, it broke the shader. <laughs> Did you see that? It went all black. People were too hard on Outer Worlds. No, they weren't. That is actually a pretty boring game. They didn't have to hit it that hard, though. It wasn't- it's not worth all the praise, though. You good? she wearing a helmet because the air is breathable here I'll restart the tether Vice time I don't think it's going to help Isaac I really don't What the fuck? It crashed. <sighs> Camera broke too. Okay, yeah, no. We're going back in. We're going to finish it. That's how many tons of rock and stone falling towards us. Well, it's a significant chunk of the planet, so... Uh... Yes. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, where am I? Actually, this is fine. We're right before that last fight. Now, why, oh why... ...did you... ...put me... ...in window mode? 
And then... Not reapply the borderless! Okay. some jabby bits. We're gonna mess up as many of these guys as possible before they can even touch us. I said Kendra, it's Nicole. <laughs> that was really good, actually. That was pretty good. All right. looking thing, isn't it? Like, you look at that thing and you say, I want to worship that. Who does that? Thank you, Isaac. <coughs> I always believed in you. Nicole. Who looks at this thing and says, I want to worship that? Do. Oh no, they are a legitimate religion, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, try this again. Where the fuck? Forget it, Isaac. There's no fixing this. Where did you Let come from? How did you get Let here? Can't you see how delusional you are? We've gotta go. The payload from the planet crack is about to fall. I gave you a chance to come around, Isaac. But if you still won't see it, I'll help you. One last time. Will you? Wrigley override. This time, watch to the end. Isaac, it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. Oh, I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. Just had a talk. That's all this research was in the end. Really? Not much, is it? No. Just had to make it listen when he begged for convergence. But I had a different prayer. It spoke. Then it listened. Make this stop, I said. Maybe it understood, but...
Then who's... Then who's that? I was wondering where she ended up. No. She can't be. What the hell did you do? You did this to yourself. Nicole's been dead this whole time. You just couldn't handle it, could you? Because if she's gone, at least now it'll be in safe hands. The marker won't turn anyone else into its puppet. Oh, she gets Give a fucking green up. marker? No. It's over. We're whole again. For Jacob's Jacob. sake, I'm not going to ask again, Cross. No, enough people will die. Then just do it. I've got nothing left to lose. Cross! It's better this way, Isaac. No, it isn't. Okay. We really need to kill her this time. We really gotta kill her this time. Okay, so Shan, that's the good news. What's the bad news? Shuttle. I can still make it before she leaves. I said press F. I'm out of med packs. <laughs> Well, now I'm not. This is a concerning amount of loot. <laughs> the bad news it'll, is it'll be back next year. That is bad news. That's really bad news. Oh, and a bench. And a store! Yeah, well, that's concerning. Alright, hang on. We have at least a few minutes. It's gonna take her forever to get back through that warehouse. Increased fire rate. If I could get just one more node, we can max out the damage on the cutter. I don't think that added anything to it. Hmm. Back from the Game Awards? I can't believe you wouldn't actually watch that. No one should subject themselves to the Game Awards. Watch other guys react to the game awards. Well, you got my reaction. It sucks. Every year they get it wrong. Every 
every year. Have you ever gotten the security suit? Uh, no? Is that a thing? Oh shit. We have so got to kill her. Okay. Not like this, though. Wait, seriously? Well, I didn't want her to go like that. That was... I will fight you. Dude, come on, that's gross. Still gross. Contact beam, got rid of it. Definitely not enough ammo. What is with all these stasis packs? Don't tell me it's gonna work on it. Now we know why they gave us stasis. Minimal commentary because I'm focusing. Oh boy. I have a 
believe I've struck a nerve. Next time, just orbital drop the marker and nuke the site. That was the plan with the military, though. They had a 20... They had a 15... 15 kiloton nuke. <laughs> they were like, if, there, if the infection is there, nuke it. to alarm you all, but we are running out of pulse rifle. Stand way over here. Oh, that's awful. No. <laughs> oh boy. I can dodge him, I just gotta keep moving. He doesn't got good hand-eye coordination. <sighs> it comes back to this thing. Cut the arena in half. This is gonna hurt. <sighs> I don't know how I dodged that one. <laughs> Are you dead yet? That'd be a big no. I am the Alpha and the Omega. Ruler and master of all, I survey. Anyway, planet's exploding, we gotta go. I'm out. Fuck that thing. It's staying here.
I suppose now's a terrible time to mention that the first letter in every level of this game, they all spell out, Nicole is dead. Well, hello. You scary fucking girlfriend. <laughs> oh, she is gonna torture the crap out of us in Dead Space 2. <laughs> Is a cheap jump scare in the end. That's how the original ended. Back in like 2008. Ugh. It's it's perfect. The game, it's it's perfect down to the <laughs> It perfect. I love Dead Space. Well, the thing is, t the thing is, Shan, this isn't the jump scary type of horror game. It's like the mo like. There's the jump scare type of horror, there's the type of horror where it's behind you and you don't know when it's gonna jump, and then there's the one where the horror is at the end of a brightly lit hallway, slowly walking towards you, strumming a violin. That's this game. Second one is usually the most effective. This game? does not scare me. I don't know if it's scared anybody, honestly. A lot of people say, oh, that game is so scary. It, it's really not. I am numb to this game. <laughs> Okay. I knew they were about to burst because they put in, couldn't put in a ton of cheap jump scares. They didn't put any real jump scares in this game, though. They were really good about it. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna try to get Streamlabs to respond to me. Let me see. It's not working. Why aren't you working? Uh, 
I don't get it. This stupid program. Oh, and Discord is broken too, so I'm going to have to close that and reopen that. Uh, have you tried asking nicely? <laughs> All right. Well, Saturday is anime night. So just don't miss that. That's our last stream of the week. Uh, Friday night, I should be able to start working on next week's schedule. We'll see what happens. How am I going to end this? I can't go to the end screen now. Uh, I'm just going to... I'm, I'm, I'm just going to peace out. I'll see you guys Saturday. <laughs> uh, we will do... I was thinking we'll start uh, the second Dead Space maybe next year. I haven't decided yet. I really want to collab with someone on the third one, though, so I want to work on that. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I'll see you guys on Saturday. <laughs>